Hello everybody, this is Fino bringing you another wonderful pack opening today. Guess what we're opening? Take a guess. You'll notice it's not behind me anymore. It's not behind me. It's because it's over here. It's right here. Here we have it. This is what we're opening today. Boom. So, can you guys as an audience please count the foil cards? I'll do it with you. One, two, three, four, five, six. Six. Up here, it says include seven foil promo cards. So, I know I can count up to six. And I know I can make it to at least ten. I mean, there, there's not seven. There's not seven here. Somewhere in here, theoretically, there's a seventh. So we're going to try to find it. Theoretically. I am not holding out a lot of faith. I don't understand why they would print that. The box is empty. Nothing in there. So, got a nice plastic casing. No cards here, as you can see. So, we have one Mew. Very beautiful card. Biggest reason I actually bought the entire thing. We have one Shaman. Also very nice. We have a Magirna. Very gorgeous looking card. We have ourselves a Meloetta. Very pretty. We have ourselves a Genosect. Very, very cool card. We have ourselves, I'm going to pick up all the boosters. And, ah, hit the mic. And we have ourselves a, this guy, Arceus. Very cool. And I found the seventh. The seventh was hiding behind a booster. And it is a Manaphy. Menifee, sorry. My bad. Very cool looking. So, yeah. I don't know why they hide one. Like, if you're going to brag about it, I mean... Show all seven, right? I mean... And then, we get five random boosters. So, this is a pricey pack. It typically goes for, like, 30 to $50, depending on how lucky you are. I found it for 25 and picked it up. And, I mean, it does come with all seven foil cards. That alone is pretty cool. Now that I actually found the seventh, that is very cool. comes with all of these guys. And it comes with the five packs. The five packs at four bucks a pack. Eh, you're at 20 bucks. So they charge a lot for these foil cards. But maybe, just maybe, we can pull something nice out of here. Just maybe. I'm not super high hopes. Um, this one box has been sitting there for like ever. Um, every time I've gone to the store, it's been sitting there. We got a Gothita, a Fennekin. So I don't know if that means like people just don't trust this kit or what. Seal, Burmy, Larvitar, Shiny Vullaby. And behind him, we have ourselves a, whoa, dude, first pull, a Dino EX. Hell yes. That is boss. Look at that. I'm very happy with him. So far, worth it. All worth it. Trainer card, a Whimsicott, a Braxian. So I'm actually currently sorting my cards right now, trying to pull out all the dupes. Um, so I've been going through and trying to sort them all up. We got ourselves a Steam Siege pack. I'm starting to run out of stuff to open, so we'll have to see what happens. Got ourselves a Ponita. Got ourselves a Pontiard. I never get anything good from these ones, the Steam Siege. I have very bad luck. A Rufflet. Tangela. A Shiny Burge Might. Behind him, we have ourselves a Yon Mega. Pretty average. An A Palm. Oh, an Ambi Palm. Well, sure. A Lampent. And a Azumarill. So. Not too great. We're going to open up a Blastoise Evolutions pack. So yeah, the Aldino is a really solid pull. I mean, I'm not going to complain right there, to be perfectly honest. We got ourselves a Seal, 
a Magikarp. I don't expect anything good from the Generations packs anymore. Caterpie, Ghastly, Shiny Poliwhirl, Beedrill. Yeah, see, I don't expect anything great from these anymore. Even though they were like the packs that I started opening on the channel. Um, I'm hoping something cool will come out of the breakthrough that I got though. Because I don't have a lot of breakthrough decks. So, we'll see. No high hopes here. We got a Ratatata. Got an original Vulpix. An Electabuzz. Magikarp. Ghastly. Shiny Coughing. And, meh, Starmie. A Blastoise Spirit Link. A Switch. And a Machoke. So, so far, the only good thing we've pulled is a Sardino. We only got one pack left. So, it's a breakthrough. Don't see a lot of these anymore um, at my stores I go to anyway. They're a little harder to find. So, I'd love to pull something good out of this since I have a hard time finding the packs. But, here we go. Panseer. Ice Cone Guy. Panapore. Ralts. Ooh, I like that. Zorua. Ooh, a shiny heavy ball. That's pretty cool. And behind him we have a... That's lame. That is really lame. What a lame, lame rare. He's kind of cool. That was lame. That was even a white one. I should have gotten something good from that. Well... Maybe it's because the Pokeball... Is that a rare? No, it's just a common. I don't understand why I didn't get anything good from that. Maybe it's so old that the colorings have shifted, so it's just not the same anymore. I don't know. I was hoping for something good, but we did We did get this guy. I mean, I'm still really happy with that. That is a really cool card. So we got him, and then we pulled all of these guys here from the pack. So eight great-looking cards with some great art worth it well worth it to me thank you all very much for watching if you enjoyed this pack opening please feel free to leave a like give a share and come back soon for some more pack openings and gameplay footage of the various games here on the channel thank you very much and as always till the next video